We want to be able to identify some, some key features of relations and functions. And, and in order to start out by doing that, we've got to start out with a few definitions. And you'll need to write these down. First of all, what is a relation? Well, a relation is, in math, a set of ordered pairs. Set of order pairs we often refer to as X and Y. In a relation, we identify two parts. We identify a domain. And the domain has a couple of names. We can call it an input. It's the first value in a relation or the X value. And another part of a relation is what we call the range. Call that the output or the Y value. Now a function, it's a special type of relation where there's only one output value for each input value. Another way we might say that, we might say for every input, there's a unique output. One of the ways that uh, we can test a function is with something called a vertical line test. We can write relations as graphs, equations, tables, or mappings. But if they're graphs, we can use a vertical line test. Really a simple thing, it's a relation is a function if and only if a vertical line does not 
hats, there are more than one point on the ground. And we'll look at some examples of those and explain that a little more clearly in just a minute. So those are some of the basic definitions we need to start identifying key features of relations and functions.